magnificent altar of Zeus is located in Pergamon, a city on the northwest coast of Asia Minor. King Eumenes II erected the altar on the Acropolis in Pergamon. It was set in around the first half of the 2nd century BCE. He wanted to honour the achievements of his father, Attalus I, against the Gauls. The altar itself is placed on a high base and is surrounded by an ionic colonnade and dedicated to Zeus and Athena Nikephoros. Surrounding the altar, at around 113 metres long, is the Great Frieze. The subject of the frieze is the Gigantomachy, the mythical battle between the Greek gods and the race of the giants. The restoration of this frieze, displayed in the Pergamon Museum in Berlin, took around 20 years. One key theme of the scene is a triumph of the gods which can be mirrored with the success of the Attalids over the Gauls, preserving Greek civilization. The most emotionally charged scene of the Great Frieze is the goddess Athena's fight with the giant Alcyoneus. In this scene, the giant reaches towards Athena in supplication with one arm, the other reaching towards his mother Gaia, who is rising from the earth with arms raised, pleading with the goddess of war to spare the life of her son. To the right of Athena is Nike, the goddess of victory, who is shown to be placing a crown on the goddess's head, reflecting Athena's inevitable triumph over her opponent. The number of divinities and the forms of many of the giants were never before seen in Greek art of the 6th and 5th centuries, reflecting the unique character of this monument and demonstrating the altar's place as the most important monument of the Attalid dynasty and Hellenistic art. In the colonnade above the Gigantomachy stand the Muses. The Muses were the divine daughters of Zeus and memory. Standing above the scene of the Gigantomachy, they record the feats of the gods and secure them in the memories of mortals for eternity.